Alrighty, hope you're doing good. But today we'd start out just using our black. I'm using Mars Black and Titanium White. Also have the colors running down below. I'm gonna go ahead and start, start right there. I'm just gonna start putting these X's and, and moving this around and getting some action going here. There we go. And of course, I wanna thank you so much for taking a moment out of your time to check this out and spend a moment with me. And hopefully, if this is your first time, you enjoy everything, and hopefully you'll just subscribe. And I want to thank everybody else that has definitely, definitely helped out the channel by subscribing and all that good fun stuff. I thought today we would do, do kind of a, uh, I'm going to go ahead and just right now and just put some water in because we'll have it anyway. So I'm just going to just load it up. And I'm just going to go straight across, straight across, and I'm going to probably darken that also. Go about there, maybe a little bit more, maybe a little bit more. So I'm going to do a pirate ship. So someone reached out and asked if I would do a pirate ship, and they kind of wanted something in the cove and stuff like that. I just figured I'd do something a little bit more like, I don't know, like a ghost type of ship, maybe somewhere in the... Bermuda Triangle, so I'm going to go a little bit darker down here. There we go. I want it nice and dark. And then we'll lighten it up. And you notice the stroke is going side to side, side to side. There we go. And I hope you're doing good where you're at. It's been quite busy for me. Usually, uh, you know, things are going good. I can get a painting out once a week or so, but if I'm busy, it's, you know, takes a little bit. Excuse me, got a little fuzzy. Let me try to knock that off. There we go. And I just want some, some action, just like it's very foggy, kind of like a sea fog, the mood to triangle, some kind of, some kind of ship. We'll figure something out. We'll figure something out. There we go. Get another, a little hair. So if you get a little spot like that, you just blend it on in, okay? And I'm gonna go ahead and I think I'll just tap into a little bit of this white. A little bit of this white, there we go. And I'll just put it in here. There we go. I just want something where you don't know if it's a sky and, and water and, and stuff like that. I want something nice. Nice and misty. There we go. And so very softly, I'm just going to sit in here and kind of just do my X's and kind of blend everything. There we go. There we go. Uh, another little, little fuzzy. There we go. And maybe just a little bit, just a little bit darker up here. There we go. I want to draw the attention right here today, okay? Right there. There we go. There we go. Nice and beautiful. And then very softly. Let's try to get those little streaks I got going on out, just like so. And you got yourself a nice little, nice little begin. And I'm going to take that same dirty two inch brush. I'm just going to pull a little. Actually, I'm going to put this down. I forgot, I got this old, old Bob Ross round brush, the big one. And I'm going to go ahead and just tap in, tap in a little bit of color here. And I'm just going to put some stuff. We'll start over here. There we go. This is just going to be some, some background stuff. I wouldn't even worry. If you have your two inch brush, one inch brush, you can do the same thing. And I'm going to go ahead and just tap some stuff in and I'll probably just blend it and all that stuff. So I won't worry too, too much about detail. I just want some kind of, just something in the background, you know, just something in the background. And I'm just, just tapping like so, okay? Yeah, maybe a little bit. Maybe 
be. There we go. Just tap, 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 tap for roost. Just don't worry about too much. Like I said, this is just background music. Just background music. I'm gonna take that dirty brush I had. It doesn't have too, too much paint on it. Well, actually, I guess it has a lot. Excuse me, let me, uh, let me just wipe that out. Let me put that down. I'll grab this other brush here that doesn't have any paint on it. Make sure you have a clean paint, a uh, clean paint, a clean, uh, clean dry brush. And you're just gonna come right back over this. And here's our light source, so you want to just be careful not to get this gray into here, okay? And I'm just just doing the axes, just just to kind of just blend everything out, nice. There we go. There we go. Another hair. Work that out. There we go. I'm gonna put this down on the grab. No, I'll just use a, a one inch brush. I'm just gonna grab some white. And I just want to brighten. Maybe I'll just just tap. There we go. Just tap, and this way it'll make it look a little bit misty and kind of like a sea fog. It's what I'm looking for. I want something that's way out there out way out you know far far and out deep and it's dark and it's misty and you got that fog working and and so that's that's what i'm looking for and maybe maybe just a little bit more just a little bit more right there there we go and I'm just going to do my little crisscrosses, the little X strokes, and just kind of just kind of blend that in there. There we go. There we go. You got some nice, nice action with the fan brush. I'm using a, this is actually a number four, but it's more like a number number three, to be honest. Um, but I'm just, just going to tap into a little bit, a little bit of white and kind of maybe just rub it out. I want to have a little bit of a little bit of water action in the background, okay? All I'm doing is this nice little rocking motion. There you go. And it just puts, puts a little bit of water in the background and maybe I'll add just a little bit of dark to it just so it can kind of yeah, we just just add a little bit of dark. There we go. Just something like so. So it kind of comes out a little bit better. There we go. And it's just that rock emotion, but it's more straight. It's like more like that, okay? And this is way, way kind of in the distance, but it just There we go. And as you can see, it just gives you a nice little, nice little something there. And just a, just barely touching. You can see the color. See, I, th I took the white and I barely put it in there and it gives me that little bit of a gray. And then with that, you can just get that nice little shimmer. And if you want, you can add a little bit more. You see? There you go. Just like that, you know? You can go maybe even a little bit. Something like that, okay? And I'm gonna go ahead and put that down. I'm gonna grab, I'm gonna go ahead and just grab my filbert brush. I'm gonna go right into this dark color here. And let's go ahead and put in a nice little boat, okay? So let's figure this out. Figure maybe uh, maybe don't worry about that. I'll cover that up. Maybe something like that. I'll come down. Actually, maybe more, more like that.
maybe something like so. We'll come in like that. All right, let's go ahead and just fill this in for now. We'll go back and kind of highlight it. There we go. Let's go ahead and just block that in. There we go, because it's going to be like that, right? So there we go, and then something like that, okay? And then I'm going to go ahead and load, load up. And I'm going to put something in right there. There we go. Let me... There we go. Go ahead and push that back a little bit. And maybe we'll have another one. Maybe this comes out something like so. And maybe we'll have another one right there. There we go. And then Oops, there we go. One there, maybe one like that. Maybe another one right there. And maybe one more. One more like that. And then let's get get one for the back here. And we'll do something like that. Maybe something like that, okay? And right now we'll just, like I said, we're just having this nice and blocked in for right now, okay? There we go. And, all right. And I'm going to go ahead and start to put in Ah, uh, maybe some lines here. Yeah. We'll go ahead and actually just go ahead and try to do some sales. So we're going to go ahead and grab some of our paint here, our white paint. Grab a nice chunk. There we go. And I'm going to grab just a, just a touch, just a touch of that dark paint. And then I'm going to come in, I'm going to touch here, and use the corner of the brush, kind of touch and there we go. It's going to need to be a little bit darker, a little bit darker. Actually, let's just go, just work with me, just bear with me, I apologize, I'm trying to compose as I go. So I'm, I think I'm just going to go more dark and then go back and drop a highlight on top of it. So something like that, okay? There we go. All right, and then grab a little bit more. And actually, I'm gonna start back here, maybe. Let's work farther away and then come in. There we go. Same thing. Dark here. Let's come in and there we go. Grab your dark again. Come over here. Same thing. Just touch and just gonna have fun with it. There we go. Something like that. And maybe this one. Something like so. Maybe 
maybe something like that, okay? And then maybe just a little bit. There we go. Maybe just a little bit more of it here. There you go. All different things. Just, you know, just put it wherever you think you'd like it. Probably be, be good. To add a couple little extra things. There we go. All right, let me go ahead and put that down. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and just use that again. I'm gonna dip it into a little bit of my white medium. I'm gonna come into the, right in here. And so it's gonna give me a little bit, maybe I should grab a little bit more white. There we go. So it's gonna give it a little bit of a highlight as you can tell, okay? And same thing here. Now I might even hold it like this, just go like that. And then come in. There we go, I'm gonna grab a little bit more of that medium. Just a tad bit more. There we go. And there we go. Same thing, like just like so. Just like so, maybe this one came out that way as well. And there we go. And then maybe right there, right there as well, whoops. There we go, easy fix. There you go. There we go. And I'm gonna put that down now. I'm gonna go ahead and grab my, for right now, I'm gonna go ahead and just grab a palette knife. I'm gonna go right into this dark. I'm just gonna, just look, you tap it like this, and go straight up, right into your color. And then I'm gonna start. Putting in, put in some lines. There we go, some cables. There you go. I don't know if you can see that. That should be zooming up. Hopefully you'll be able to see that. And let me put that down for right now. I'm gonna grab my liner brush. Give me one second here. I'm gonna go into a little bit of my paint thinner. I'm gonna go over into my dark. There we go, spin it, spin it, and then bring it to a point. And I'm gonna go ahead and just put in maybe a net. Something like so. Maybe I'll have a net down here. There you go. Maybe a little net. Maybe one right over here. Uh, maybe right here. We'll have it come out. Like so. There we go. Nice little net in there. And you can use the same thing and just start putting in, I don't know, different little things. There we go. Maybe a couple of lines. Going out like so. Something like that. And let me clean that. 
I'm going to go into my white medium with the same little liner brush and just go right here. Add a little bit of that gray, a little bit more. There we go. And let's get some, just a couple little lighter ones. Maybe, there we go. There you go. And then I'm gonna go ahead and I wanna get a little bit of a highlight going right there. So I'm gonna go ahead and use the same thing. I'm just gonna go, here's a little bit of that medium I had right here. And I'm just gonna go into the more of the gray here and lighten this up. And then paint in. There we go. There you go, a nice little highlight. And, ah, one second, I'm gonna grab another liner brush. I'm just seeing something right now. Let me see if this comes out. I might scratch in instead. I'm gonna go into the, my dark here, and I just see Something like so. There you go. I'm just putting in like some, some lines so you can see some boards. I don't know if you can see it on your end. I'll find out when I do the editing, but it's there. And then I'm gonna go ahead and do something like that. Now I'm going to go into my dark here, and I just want to just darken this a little bit since this is more of the, uh, of the shadow, I guess you can say. There we go. There we go. And I'm going to go right back into that black. right into the black. There we go. Let me get some. There we go. And I'm going to go ahead and put in some little portholes. There you go. So you got nice little portholes. And I'm going to go ahead now and just give them a little bit of a highlight. Just a little bit of a highlight. There we go. I always have shaky hands. There you go. So you got a nice little highlight to kind of stick those things out. And I think that's good for the ship. So let me go ahead and get this clean real quick. Now I'm going to go ahead and go into a, I think I'm going to go into my fan brush. I'm going to go right into my white paint here. And I'm going to go ahead and just start Start going ahead and putting in, put in some water in the background a little bit more, and then we'll have it come up. And actually, what I want to do real quick, let me go ahead and just mist the bottom of that real, real quick. Just a quick little mist. So tap into a little bit of your white paint. Mistier, so I'm going to tap into a little bit more of this white and I'm just going to focus right here there we go All right. 
Now I'm going to go into, into my white paint here. And I'm going to start I'm just doing that rocking motion. That's all I'm doing. Just a nice little rocking motion. There we go. There we go. And just, just like that. And then you can go ahead also, you can come in and just maybe have it come in, kind of crashing, maybe come in this way. There you go. You can just do whatever you like, nice and rough, nice and rough. Look at that. And then grab a little bit of your dark here. Rub some of that out, it's gonna be, it might be a little bit too dark. And you can, there you go. Start putting in some shadows. Just start putting in some shadows in these little wakes you got here. There's a little bit of water. And I apologize, it, it's been a very, very long, long month for me. Very busy at work. Very, very busy at work. And I actually did this painting last night on a black canvas and it just had such a glare, it had such an issue. So I figured, you know what, let me go ahead and do it on the regular white canvas and then hopefully it'll come out a little bit better. But unfortunately I had to be at work at five in the morning. So it's late at night right now and uh, yeah, <laughs> a little bit tired. I can always tell, you can always tell because I start to ramble. I'm gonna go into the white paint and There we go. There we go. And maybe. And a little dark. I'm just playing back and forth. Back and forth with these colors here. Now that's going to be a little bit too much, so I'm going to go ahead and just, there we go. There we go. And then I'm back into the white here. And I'll just lighten that up. There you go. There you go. Maybe a little bit darker right here. Yeah, a little bit darker over here. I mean, I just have the paint, and so since I'm not really worried about detail, that's why I'm just going back and forth. You usually don't want to apply this much paint. You know, it doesn't make your life very easy, to be honest, but Maybe just a little bit. There we go. I think that's absolutely pretty, pretty cool there. Now I'm just going to take a just gonna use this brush real quick and I just want to just, just soften this a little bit, just a little bit. There we go. There we go. Isn't that cool? It came out pretty cool. And just want to Maybe just get a little bit more of a highlight in these. Maybe just a touch of, let me grab a little bit of that medium there. Let's go a little bit more of that white medium. There we go. And just, just a little, just a little something there. So just to, I don't know, just to get the pop out just slightly, just slightly more. There we go. Maybe.
There you go. Okay. I'm going to go right into that white medium. I want to thank you so very much for taking your time to check this out. I hope this was a good painting for you. And I hope you was able to learn from it. And I'm going to go ahead and just sign. And remember, if your paint's thin, and to slide right on over this, you shouldn't have any issues. And thank you so much again. I really, really hope you have a good, good rest of your week. I hope you enjoy your weekend. And until the next painting, until next time, I really want to wish you the best. And please take care of yourself and stay safe. Thank you. And one last thing. I apologize. One last thing. I just don't like how that is. I just wanted to, want to just blend, blend that in there. There we go.